Investors reacted to the first ever downgrade of U.S. credit fast and furious. Only 43% say their children will have a better life than their own. What a brutal decade this has been for middle class Americans. American exceptionalism in the crossfire right now. America's days as the top economic superpower are numbered. China now set to grab the top spot. Start considering building a de-Americanized world. It projects that Barack Obama will be re-elected president of the United States. If I wanted America to fail, I suppose I wouldn't change a thing. It's the question that haunts us. Will America fail? Together, Americans slew the sin of slavery, vanquished the forces of fascism, overpowered evil empires, and led the torch of freedom for the whole world to see. We have overcome droughts, fires, hurricanes, and even super storms. They put a man on the moon, split the atom, wired the world, launched machines beyond the reaches of the solar system, peered into the moment of creation, and scrutinized the subatomic particles that knit the universe together. We have freed whole continents, launched countless new industries, and outlasted economic depressions and recessions time and time again. We are unique, gathered together from disparate and distant lands, many faiths, many origins, one people the most dynamic in human history. But will we soon fade away? Will we walk the twilight path of ancient empires? Will we fail? No, this story isn't ending. It's just beginning. Something is shifting in the shadows. America will not fail. Our republic will not die. Lifted by underlying economic forces, empowered by technology and fired by a Promethean spark, millennials will forge a 21st century that belongs to the United States. We will not preside over the collapse of this movement. We will reshape it in our image. How may surprise you.